from San Francisco, it's theCUBE. Covering Samsung Developer Conference 2017. Brought to you by Samsung. Hello everyone, welcome back. Live here in San Francisco, Moscone West. This is theCUBE's exclusive coverage of Samsung's Developer Conference. I'm John Furrier, the co-founder of SiliconANGLE Media and co-host here in theCUBE. My next guest is Paris Rain, a recording artist, innovator, working with Stan Lee Music Project. What's exciting about this event is that you have such exciting new lifestyle trends happening. And this one here is a great story. Welcome to theCUBE. Thank you very much. It's nice being here you with look, everybody. You look fabulous, you're a superhero. Tell us yes. a story because one of the things that's super compelling about your um, projects that you're working on and, and sure. your innovation is the convergence of culture, right? You got Comic Con kind of culture integrated with music, online services, digital communities. It's now new products are being developed, yeah. new experiences, AR, VR, a new vibe is out there. Yeah. Tell your story. Well, we just thought, I mean, why, why not? So what, ended, what happened was my manager had a really close relationship to Stan. And he basically showed Stan my music and said, hey, this girl's talented. And then we got to talking and we were like, why don't we integrate Stan into the music business? He took over the movie industry, why doesn't he take over yeah. the music industry Yeah, so as Marvel, well. obviously, obviously, it's a home run, the comics. But this is now also digital life as the people look at what all the success of, certainly the movies, right, have been Absolutely, off, yeah, off the charts. Absolutely, yeah, that would be the biggest, yeah. Right, I mean, obviously, I'm a Definitely. comic kid when I was growing up, but the movies have just been spectacular, one sequel after the other. Definitely. Gaming is now part of movie scene, so huge. gaming culture is huge. huge. You're doing a game with Samsung. We That's are. That's something you got going on. What's that about? Um, I can't say too much about <laughs> it, to be honest with you, but we're in preparation with Samsung on this new, innovative, high-tech app that's coming out, and it's going to be integrated to, I mean, everything's going to come together. It's going to have my music in it, it's going to have, Stan's going to make a cameo in my, in yeah. that, in the game, and in my uh, music video as well, and, and yeah, it's all So that's coming out, you can't really talk, it was under wraps, but it's it an integrated wraps, project. Wraps, yeah. You've been successful, you had some viral videos a couple years ago that went viral on I YouTube. Did. What's that like when, like, do you just like wake up one day and say, oh my God, I'm, this is going crazy? It kind of happens like that with YouTube because you do it all like yourself. Well, I worked, I work with Aflux Studios, it's in Wellington and um, they're a really awesome studio, super, super high tech and I got kind of an in, they're kind of family to me. So it was, it was kind of, it was really easy to get with them anyway. So we were like, hey, I did the blue hair thing. And I was like, you know what, we're just, I'm set on going like viral, like, this is what I want to do. And the first video I put out, got bitch better, ha be better have my money <laughs> by Rihanna. You can say it with the internet, with the internet. You can say whatever you oh, want. Oh, fuck it. Yeah. Bitch better have my money. Yeah. Oh, so, really, I can swear? Oh, I feel so much more comfortable Come now. On, yeah. on stage, I felt so, so yeah, yeah, so Bitch Better Have My Money came out and it got like 1.5 million, or 1.3 million views. And then um, I did another video and it got another. 1.3. All right, so what happens after? Because everyone wants to know. Yeah. Everyone, everyone tries to engineer viral. You can't really engineer viral. Because viral is one of those things where it, if, it, if it has legs. Dye your hair blue, oh. sell your soul. <laughs> <laughs> Do, uh, no. you, okay, you sold your soul. Who, do, so, who, who bought it? Um, the devil? The devil. <laughs> yeah, the devil bought it. No. Um, well, you got I would talent. say, okay, no, for like honest, honest talk right now, um, what you have to do is go on the top charts and pick one of your favorites. Something that is completely not you or you, but you have to do it a different way. So what we did was I work with a producer who's super awesome, his name's Arceus, and uh, we remixed it. And you know how remixes are huge? So we were like, why don't we do a remix cover? And then it blew up. Cool. And that's what happened. So now that you're on uh, the Stan's radar, he's got the whole music, he's, you know, he's been around the block, he's a legend in the community. Uh, legend, success yeah. Success is, is off the charts. Yeah. What's his creative mind like right now? What do you, how are you guys looking at the market? Obviously you're integrating um, music with comic. With comics and with game. That, those are, th I mean, you just nailed it. So those what's, are what's the creative scene like? You guys sit back, you kick back. What are you talking about? Stan's really big on making the powers unique. And he always has been really great on making making sure that the powers are unique. So that's right now we're still in the preparation stage of, of everything, but we're we want to we're prepping with Marvel right now. Yeah. I have to say all like the right words in order yeah, to yeah. not get in trouble. Yeah, so, the PR handlers here. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna get hit a little later. Um, we're prepping with Marvel to yeah. go into one of their storylines. Um, 
that I can't say. Yeah, and yeah, all, all these licensing much, things are going on. I mean, I've always been fascinated with um, how it's about time that the, 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 the comics and Marvel really started expanding that franchise into gaming because we were talking yesterday with um, one of the guest influencers about how the gaming culture really is a, a precursor to how life is evolving. You got multiplayer, it is virtual, there's virtual currencies, you have um, you know, things happening okay. on gaming. Yeah. Yeah. So it's a natural extension to move into gaming. How does the music yes. piece, I mean, do you guys talk about like licensing stuff? Like you must have to get like authorizations, is it indie? What's well, it would be my music that's on the game. So you're doing your own music for the game. So I'd just be paying myself. Okay, so you're, essentially. Doing, you're licensing your movie. Yeah, <laughs> the it, it's, yeah. All right, so here's a question for you. What's the um, weirdest thing that's happened to you in the past year? This, this interview one. right here. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. <laughs> no, it's been great, no, great for uh, me too. The sta Stan calling me up and saying, hey, I uh, want to make you a superhero. That's the weirdest thing I've ever gone through. What's it like in the, uh, the LA scene for you? Have you been I don't, don't go to LA too much. No. I don't, but I am moving out there next month, so I will be in the LA scene. The LA scene's crazy from yeah. what I've seen. Yeah. That's from what I've seen about the scene. Yeah, it's yeah. crazy. All right, so what's the what's the plans for you with Stan next couple months? What are you guys going to be working on? Heads down, doing the tour, creative I think we're building. going to a couple Comic-Cons. Um, potentially getting inducted into the music industry by a big player in the in the hip hop culture um, who I can't say his name there's a lot of a lot of big things but it's mainly just preparation right yeah. now we're just talking about everything what what we all want to do and making sure that yeah. the gaming app with Samsung which is why we're here today is like that's yeah. a huge thing Jackie yeah. Jacqueline Chow who's mobile game we're, it's a mobile game yeah so the game the music and the it will hopefully eventually movies but and the comic books she must be pretty oh, excited you know what i think is really cool i think that we're going to do a comic book on like a ta like a tablet version or a mobile version of the comic book and i don't know if you've seen i forget what it's called but it's like a tilt screen comic book that's really mm -hmm. it's really innovative i have to show you the app after but it's, I think we're going to do something like that because people don't buy comic books. People don't buy books. And they don't go to the store. They don't go to the library. I mean, I do. But they don't, you know, yeah. they go on their phone and they pay for it. Yeah, the it. phone is where the action is for the kids right? these days. Yeah. All right, so what's exciting you these days? Obviously, what, I mean, you must be pretty pumped. I mean, things are rocking. Yeah. What's, what's on your pumped. mind these days? What's on my mind these days? Yeah, what are you excited days? about? Sitting beside Stan and, I mean, just talking about this stuff. Yeah. Honestly, performing. I'm yeah. super excited about the show because yeah. I want the show <laughs> to be. I mean, if I'm a superhero, it's got to be heroic. Can you share super like your superpowers? Heroic. Like, what's the? I can't. Okay, oh, sweet. I can't. You got to get it out. But of I you. am a singer, so okay. uh, I think obviously we're gonna we're gonna roll with the singing because I think, I mean, naturally singing, performing, I think is uh, is almost like a human superpower that we have. All right. So what's the event? Give us a take on your the event here. Obviously, Samsung's a big partner. Congratulations. Mm. It's a nice gig to have there. Congratulations. Yes, so you got the app coming on. We'll yeah. dig into that. We'll look forward to the, the news when it comes out. Yeah. But the vibe here, this developer community, we see we see high school kids here. I saw yeah. some eight-year-olds here. I mean, it's like an awesome developer conference. It is. When I was on stage with Stan, I was like, we had five minutes left and I was kind of, you know, we had gone through all the questions that we prepared and I was like, hey, uh, Guys, if anyone has any questions, please raise your hand or whatever. And just kid, it was all it was like mostly kids at first, and then the and then the adults were like, oh well, we can do it too. But the kids were like, Stan, <laughs> what do you think about DC? <laughs> and he was like, DC who? It was hilarious. <laughs> it was Next really year, fun. Rain, what do you think about? So you're gonna be popular. Congratulations. Thanks for coming on and chatting with me. It's been Thank great. you so much. And Rain Paris here on the Cube live in San Francisco for SDC. You got games coming out, music converging with comics. This is the culture, more after this short break.